What's up guys, it's your boy Rich here. So what do you get when you cross a military watch with a diver's watch? You get a Hemel. So let's go take a look at Hemel's Hydrodurance. Let's go. And here is the newest addition to the Hydrodurance lineup. And it's in 42 millimeters, 46 from lug to lug, 12 millimeters tall, and with a 22 millimeter lug width. And one of the first things that caught my attention about the Hydrodurance is the sandwich dial. I think it automatically gives off a certain military look and I think that's a really cool look. But I really like the way that this bezel inlay looks. I think it looks terrific. And you know, for some of us, it probably will remind us of Blancpain's 50 Fathoms because it certainly reminded me of it. But if the bezel inlay is the only element that reminds me of Blancpain, then I think that's fine because I think Hemel did a really nice job of incorporating a very similar look with the bezel inlay to an otherwise original creation. And some of you might also remember my Torby Lawless video where I raved about the material that was used as the bezel inlay, which is sapphire. And guess what? Hemel also uses a genuine sapphire as their bezel insert. And I am a really big fan of sapphire. I think it gives off certain glints of different colorations. It definitely has a different texture and feel and look that we simply can't get from ceramic. And earlier I mentioned that this is the newest addition to the Hydrodurance family. And that's because this is the all black edition done in a DLC. But the Hydrodurance also comes in a variety of colors. It also comes in orange, red, gray, green, navy, and black. I think Hemel did a nice job of making a 42 millimeter watch in diameter fit just about any wrist, particularly those with smaller wrists, including my six and a half inch wrist. By making a shorter lug length of 46 millimeters from lug to lug, instead of the more common 50 or 51 that comes with a lot of 42 millimeter size watches. So I think this wears really nicely. The bezel is a unidirectional 120 click count and it has this knurling texture all around the bezel and crown for grip and a really cool look. It is water resistant to 300 meters and it uses the C3 Super Luminova. And one of the things I wanted to point out about the Sapphire Crystal is in a lot of cases it's either flat or slightly domed. In the case of Hemel it actually rests below uh, the bezel inlay allowing this look, allowing the bezel inlay to pop. I really like this look a lot. So now let's get into the turn action. Here we go. It sounds really nice. There's a nice amount of resistance and a nice uh, feeling in our fingertips. As far as back play, let's check that out. Well, there is some, but I would classify this as a next to none, none or next to none back play. Certainly nothing terrible at all. So I think Hamill did a really nice job with the look of the bezel and its performance. As far as the bracelet, it's nice, it's fine, but I wouldn't say there's necessarily anything worth writing home about. And when we open it, it there's the two folds and it is lacking a diver's extension. It does snap securely into place. And I will say that this is an extremely comfortable watch on the wrist. And I just had the bracelet open and we had a glimpse where we had a glimpse of the solid case back that is tastefully done. And according to Hemel's website, it has it described as the classic relief. It is nice and deeply engraved, done in a polished finishing, a uh, very tastefully done uh, case back by Hemel. And because this is a solid case back, what is the movement that is powering the HD? Well, it is powered by the Miyota 9039 automatic movement with 42 hours of power reserve. And it is a high beat movement. And the retail price of the HD is $599. And I think for that, we are getting a really nicely made watch with that pays nice attention to detail, including the knurling around the bezel and the crown. And just this gorgeous, gorgeous front. This is this bezel inlay and a dial that gives off both a military feel and a diver's watch at the same time. I just think this is an extremely attractive package. And Hemel does something that is a little different that I don't think I've come across before. So the, the individual price of the HD is $599. But they have a five pack priced at $2,400. So if we break that down, five watches for that price comes out to about $480. And you know, when I first saw that, I was wondering, would having basically five of the same watch just in 
five different dial colors be a little excessive. But, you know, I, I really do like that orange one uh, and that red one and the gray one. But the more I thought about it, I, I think that five pack would be better suited to buy and hand these watches out as gifts. So I think that would be or, or that would make better sense. Every purchase comes with this genuine leather Hemel key fob, which is a really nice touch. So now I want to show you what's in this orange tube back here. Hemel sent me some goodies, uh, basically because we have the upcoming Father's Day and Graduation Day. So this is basically a gift idea for dads and grads. So I'm going to open this orange cylinder in dramatic fashion to see what's inside. And inside we get this leather travel roll. And, you know, it's not just leather. It's a really high-quality, supple sheepskin that is also vegetable-dyed and hand-waxed. So if it looks really supple and oily on camera, well, that's because it is in person. This is a nice quality travel roll. So here's a Velcro, and let's take a look uh, at it inside. There it is, suede lined that holds three watches. So I'm going to close this and put the size into perspective compared to my hand. So this is basically the size of our wallet or or billfold that can hold three watches. So this would make a really ideal travel companion. But for me, you know, I, I would actually use this to store some of my watches and keep this on the dresser because this would take up a lot less room than some of the watch boxes that come with the watches. So I think for for compact purposes, something that we can store a couple of watches. I think this is a really great idea. So I'm definitely going to enjoy the use of my leather travel roll. And the price of the travel roll is $69.99. Thanks for joining me and I'll see you the next time. It's water resistant to 300 me So when Marvin told me about the When Marvin told me about the hydro during It's 46 millimeters 40 from lug to no, it's 40 millimeters 46 uh.